my hair is on fire for the my special basement year-end sale I mean 50% off for two weeks only for my basement clearance sale and part of those proceeds will go to the find food bank so you're not only getting a deal on a painting but you're helping people feed the hungry all right so the basement sale here we go my hair's on fire all right um and my tr is coming off so let's go through these are a variety of desert scenes i'm not going to go through each one of these i can hold up some other paintings but you have everything from death valley Joshua Tree, the Salton Sea, the Airport in Palm Springs, 29 Palms, Joshua Tree, one of my favorite places in New Mexico, out in the middle of nowhere, El Rancho Verde in the desert of California. And then over here we've got, this is up in the hills right below Idlewild. This is a special house they built for Modernism Week in the hills of Palm Springs. This is Borrego, the campground in Borrego Springs, campground in Joshua Tree. And these two little vintage trailers stuck, snuggled together on the way back from Borrego. And then people living down this very interesting, lonely road in Joshua Tree. I call that the road to somewhere. And this is, I call this Buenos dias, Mother Earth, because I painted this in the morning when the earth was just starting to wake up from the sun. And last but not least, Joshua Tree on a misty day, a very mystical place. Uh, so that's Joshua Tree National Park. Now I'm gonna hold up several others. All right, this is a Times Square scene, crossing the divide in Times Square. All the pricing will be on the website. Here we've got a scene, a classic scene in Palm Springs of a vintage hotel with the folded plate roof design. And a fun hotel here called the Art Hotel in Palm Springs. And uh, uh, a person named Tracy Turco just redid this and just made it really killer with all the beautiful art artistic colors. Got another one here, the opposite end of the spectrum. This is called From On High. And this is from up above uh, in a high rise, from a high rise in downtown Los Angeles, looking down on the swimming pool of the Pegasus condo building and all the different buildings surrounding that. So that's a fun one with a unique perspective. Another scene in LA, which is a different kind of scene, and that is Ray's on Pico. So Ray's on Pico is a famous diner that's been there, very mid-century modern, probably from the 30s, I'm not quite sure. Um, but Rendezvous at Ray's is what this one is called. And then we've got another vintage place, Crystal Cove. So I painted this standing in the, in the ocean in the surf there. And these are the vintage cottages at Crystal Cove that they've been rehabilitating in just a special little place there. All right, we've got a few more here. This one, another vintage place. I'm starting to see a theme here. Um, the uh, El Rancho, which is the Rancho Mirage Elephant Car Wash. And people just love this. I don't know if you can see that. People just love this elephant sign it's so crazy and uh, I was driving by it late in the day I'm like oh my gosh I got to get that pink in there that's just too fun all right a few some more here we've got the Monterey which is a vintage motel that still operates on Route 66 and the guy is just kind of walking down the hot sidewalk there then we've got, this is uh, one that actually is kind of, it could be anywhere. I call it the bewitching hour and it's just a very quiet place under the trees with the shadows and light coming through. And 
another one, another favorite place, the Back Bay in Newport Beach. I call this day is done because it's the end of the day and the colors are just going crazy there. I'm gonna come back to another one that I'm not sure I'm gonna put in the in the basement sale, but we'll hold that up at the end. And a couple more. This one is called You Cast a Spell on I cast a you, I cast a spell on you. And this is the vintage has the plastic on it, so the, uh, but anyway, it's the vintage gas station in the Mojave Desert that has been in many movies and it's on a spur, spur of Route 66. So check out that vintage car there at the bottom. How crazy is that? They have that parked there now, so it makes, makes, fun, makes it fun for artists. And, let, and one more here, and then I think two the pièce de résistance that I'll show you. This is a vintage motel that's been redone in Ojai, California called the Capri Hotel. When I came out, we were staying there and I saw the, the way the sign looked and the lights at night. That really captured my fancy. All right, now let's see. This one, I'm not 100% sure, but if somebody wants to bid on it at 50% off, I would consider letting it go. So this is the, the Hollywood sign from the back and then the glittering lights of Los Angeles down below. And I just, uh, I don't know, it's one of my favorites. That's why I'm hesitant, but for a good cause, I would let it go. And last but not least, another iconic place, the El Cortez Hotel. And this, I call this Midnight Blue at the El Cortez. We used to live right across the street from it. And it's been there, I think it just had its I think they just had the 80th birthday celebration of the El Cortez. So it's been there in downtown Las Vegas all those years and still very uh, retro when you see it. This one is, is a large painting, you can tell from looking at me. Um, I would say it would be best if it might go to someone in the Palm Springs area because uh, otherwise it might be a little expensive to ship but you're gonna get a 50% off deal, so maybe it'll be worth it. All right, that is, did I miss anything? I think that's the year-end basement sale. Once a year, 50% off on, on these paintings, and part of those proceeds go to the Find Food Bank. So, dial in, I'll post a link. You can, these will all be on my website on a special page so you can look at them more closely and you can buy right from there and uh, contribute to a good cause. All right. Merry Christmas. Feliz Navidad.